the Land Transportation Office, has created an online portal as part of the agency's creative endeavors. Applicants for driver licenses and other transactions can now do so online. On May 18, 2020, the Land Transportation Management System portal was released by the LPO. The LTMS includes features such as a student driver permit application, a driver conductor renewal application, requests for record revisions, and requests for certificates of no apprehension. In this video, we'll go through how to apply for a driver's license online from the comfort of your own home, utilizing a computer, tablet, or smartphone, and bypassing long lines at LTO offices. Step 1. Go to the LTMS portal. Then, click Register Now for New Users. Otherwise, click Login. Step 2. Carefully read the Terms of Agreement. If you agree to it, simply tick the box that says, Yes, I accept at the bottom of the page, encode the security code in the blank box provided, and then click the Next. Step 3. Select and roll as an individual to proceed with the registration. The LTMS portal offers a convenient way to register both the companies and individual motorists. Since the focus of this guide is individual applicants, select and roll as an individual. Step 4. Answer the question on whether you have an existing license or not. If you already have an existing license, select Yes, you will then have to provide the license number, the expiry date, and an answer to a security question. Double check your information before proceeding to the next step. The existing license holder will have to provide some information before clicking on Create Account. For old design, driver's license holder, in creating your LTMS account, the first question will be, do you have a Philippine driver's or conductor's license? Kindly select, no, and then proceed to complete the client information. The following steps are for those who selected no. Step 5. Answer the question regarding your nationality. Are you a Filipino citizen? Step 6. Provide your details, fill in the requested information in the boxes provided. This include your name, birth date, gender, and your mother's maiden name. Once you're done, click Next. Step 7. Provide your contact details including your email address and phone number. Fill in the requested information and then click Create Account to proceed to the next step. Step 8. Click the link sent to your email address to verify your account. You should receive the email almost instantly, if you can find it in your inbox, check if it's in your spam folder. Make sure to access the link within 24 hours otherwise, your account will be automatically deleted. Step 9. Create your password and make sure to follow these guidelines. Must have at least 8 characters. Must contain at least 1 alphabetic character. Must contain at least one number. Must have a combination of upper and lower case alphabets. Once you're done, click Reset Password for Login. Step 10. Sign into your account using your new password. Username is already provided. Since this is the case, don't forget to tick the box that says Member Username, so the system will remember your profile username the next time you log in. Step 11. On the home page, there are four icons. Select the licensing on your dashboard to access the online license application. Step 12. 
step 12. Complete your online application form. Some of the questions have already been answered during the previous steps. Complete all the fields with red marks as they are vital in your application. Vital information that will be requested from you includes your educational attainment, place of birth, eye color, height, weight, emergency contact person, and your complete address. When you're finished, click Apply Changes. You'll be redirected to the dashboard. Click the licensing, again, read the terms of use, and click Accept. After that, the succeeding steps will then ask you to select the following details, including Type of license Student's driver's permit Driver's license Or conductor's license Type of application New application Renewal Revision of records Application for additional codes, etc. And The preferred appointment schedule and LTO office Note, the setting of appointments through the LTO Online Pass is a free public service offered by the LTO. If you have experience being charged in exchange for setting appointments, report immediately at 922-9061-63. You can also pay for the fees online. However, some transactions such as the new application and license renewal, will require you to input your medical certificate number, otherwise, the process will not resume. Make sure to secure a medical certificate ahead before proceeding online application.